hi guys welcome back to my channel today we're going to unbox and customize the barbie pet stroller set so here's how it looks like without the plastic on it and it's just a millie face mold doll with straight hair a striped dress and she comes with these accessories here which include water bottle frisbee two dog bowls with the dog bones and the doggy bag and of course the stroller and two dogs oh and she has on pink high top sneakers so what i like about this stroller is it can open up to make room for two things and i thought oh i can have twins and i can have a little twin stroller and so here are the babies in there and disclosure after i paint it i don't shove the baby all the way to the back under the hood of the stroller because it is a tight fit and I didn't want the paint to scratch. However, the babies do still fit. And I'm not mad at this pale pink, but I do want to go ahead and repaint and customize this doggy bag. I want to turn it instead into a diaper bag. So before I paint, I disassemble, disassemble, whatever, the stroller. And the blue part, the handle part, is actually hard to get back on. So I don't know if you want to dismantle the entire stroller. These are the two colors I'm using. You don't have to use these, but I just picked these up from Hobby Lobby and I have them in my collection. So those are the ones I'm going with. So this is everything painted in the solid colors of that kind of tannish yellow brown and that kind of charcoal black. And it looks good, you can stop here if you want to, but I'm going to add some shading to make it look like real leather. Let's get started with that step right now. I'm using my Tombow brush pen. You can use paint or whatever. <laughs> I just like this one because I like the control. So you wanna go into the crevices, I guess you could say, of the item and then take a damp brush and just rub it in to make the shading effect. I'm not going to talk a lot through this part because it's really just showing you how to do it. And so just enjoy the music as you watch.
so here is the finished product of how that looks and don't worry i do take this out into natural lighting where i think it really shows up the best and as you can see i have the babies in a different way i find they fit the best when you bend their legs where they're like kneeling and then you can just put them in there i find that they fit the best in the stroller this way so now i need to customize two bottles do not buy these bottles from amazon they are way cheaper at hobby lobby so the first thing i do is paint it silver and then i go in with the mustardy color i got that one from walmart and i just paint the little the mouth part of it and then i paint the inside of this one with white paint to symbolize milk and i like this one because the dolls can like put their finger in the bottom of it so it's like they're holding it so a neat trick to do on one of your bottles is to have it like this paint it in such a way that when it's tilted down it looks like the milk is kind of at a slant as well i hope that's right <laughs> So now I'm going to make a little blanket. Because this blanket is just a prop, I cut out a small piece. You don't need a full size blanket. And I just fold that over and then I fold it over again. I make two because twins and I rubber band it. And then I just place it into the diaper bag. So a simple hack if you want your items to sit up higher, just use some stuffing or something. I'm using felt and it just goes like that. And now the bottles are not going to go straight down to the bottom. They're going to sit kind of near the top so you can actually see them well. This clear water bottle, by the way, is from the Barbie Gymnast set, I believe. I like it so much better than the blue bottles because it looks realistic. I use elastic, stretchy elastic, to make diapers. I cut four pieces and fold them in half and then run a string through them to hold them together. And then I put them into the diaper bag. Now I do have a diaper tutorial, so comment below if you wanna see that tutorial. I didn't post it because I didn't like the lighting in the video, but I think I still have it and I can still post it. So comment below if you want to see that video. And here is the finished product outside. I think it looks really, really nice. I've dressed the twins in twin outfits. And they are just a whole vibe. Look how nice and leathery that looks. And this is a reel that I made. If you follow my Instagram or even YouTube, you probably have seen this reel. Lastly, here are some photos that I took. And I think they turn out really nicely. So thank you guys so much for watching my video. Like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Bye.